Hey everybody, this is a quick video in case you have a Flexi remote access gateway, a 201 or a 202, 203, 204, 205, we'll work on all those. And you need to do a hard reset to the factory default settings on it. It's called a level two reset where you reset everything, all of the user information and all of the system information like the, the IP address and all that kind of stuff. Now you're going to want to do this for troubleshooting if it won't connect if it seems to be frozen or not responding and you've already tried the level one reset or if you're just trying to get this back to the way it was when it came out of the box you want it to just be like new um, we can do this pretty easily first thing we need to do is find the reset button on this 205 it's right here it looks like this it's in a slightly different spot depending on which one you have and you're going to need like a paper clip or something to stick in there and press the button so basically what you need to do is turn it off the device off and then turn it back on and then as soon as you turn it back on you start to press and hold that reset button and then the BL1 light will light up and then after about 30 seconds the USR uh, light will blink red you just want to keep pressing it while it's blinking if you let go you'll just get a, a, a level 1 reset so you're just going to keep holding it for about 35 seconds until it goes solid red once it's solid red then you can release it and then you just got to let it sit after about 15 seconds the reset will start um, it'll go through a diagnostics mode and all this kind of stuff with different lights. Just let it finish and do its whole thing. After that, um, you can just, uh, it'll power off and then you, it'll power back on. And when the USR light blinks green, it's ready to be set up as a new device.